Ladies and gentlemen, your home run derby champion, Matt Antonelli. What's going on, everyone? We're back with another road to the show. Today, we've got Matt raking as usual. Real life Matt, actually. I think I've been playing too much of this game because I don't know if you guys saw, I've decided to become a two-way player. Go check out my video, probably from like a couple days ago. Can I throw 90 miles an hour? Uh, I don't know just yet, but I think I'm gonna try. Go check it out. You can also leave it in the comment section below in this video if you want to see me try to throw 90 miles an hour. Maddie thinks he can throw 90 miles an hour. He's right there. You look excited, dude. He is so thrilled to watch video game map play right now. He's actually not, he'd rather play. But you know what? I said, it's been a couple days. I got up nice and early to play today. And I don't know if he heard my footsteps coming down the stairs or what, but he's here. He said, I gotta watch video game, Matt. I can't let him play and not watch him. Select my loadout. That isn't what I said. I know, that was called a joke. What did you say? I was trying to come down and beat the TV. No, I know, <laughs> I know. Also, update on the basement, since so that's just reminded me. And I gotta shave, wow. And when I, um, when I rock my first every time I look I know. Matt is like the, the straw that stirs the drink. Did you see that right there? He's like Reggie Jackson. I know you do. He's already downstairs. Yeah, so Maddie's been waking up early, like super early every day. Yesterday I woke up at 627. Yeah, well, I just let him tell you the story. Yeah, it's been like six something, but he goes to bed like a teenager. Like he doesn't go to bed like a little, uh, no, he's not 36. I flew out. Oh, nice catch out there, dude. I know how old you are. That was a great catch right here. Look, this is a future Matty Jr. right here. The left-handed center fielder. Tops. Oh, he's only running 18.56. I am on the Barons. All right, I got to move yeah, over in case you steal. Yes, I'm. All right, we got all messed up there. We got all messed up because I wanted to flip the ball, but then it didn't let me flip me. It didn't let me flip it. Yeah, yeah, it's not an error. But let me show you something real quick here before Matt hits a homer, okay? Matt, you listen up to this. You'll never play middle infield because you're a lefty, but you might in middle league. All right, so there's a ground ball here. We've got to communicate here, all right? Like, and you've got, like, how do you know, dude? I didn't say a word. How do you know that you're not supposed to keep going to cover the bag? Maybe I decided to flip, which I did try to do because I didn't even know you could, well, I, I guess you could take it yourself in this game, but I don't think I've ever taken it myself. So right here, I've got to say, bag, bag, bag. So I know that I'm taking it, and he knows that I'm taking it, so he gets out of the way. So I go to flip it, and I'm like, oh, shoot, they're not going to let me. Then Matt, a little bit more grace here. He stomps on it like he's trying to put out a fire. Like, just, what are you doing, Matt? Get, get ready to get the ball out of your glove. He stomps on it, and then he goes, oh, I guess now I'll throw. As I'm running in the wrong direction, I'll try this Derek Jeter thing. So horrible fundamentals thank you number two i don't know your name but thank you for saving an error for me right there all right we got first and second we got one out here's the first pitch dude i got hecklers now no he uh yeah he's 76 contact you're right why doesn't he have any power? No! <coughs> Why does 
That was such a bad breaking ball. Did you wake up to just rip on me? That was such a bad breaking ball. It just sat there and spun. And so it looked like it was in slow motion, but it never felt, it just like never came down into the strike zone. It was such a bad pitch. Here's a little chopper up the middle. Fielded cleanly. The second for one. Whoa! Little delayed flip by Matt there. Who's flip like that? This guy right here. I'll see you in the parking lot, bird. Could have been an easy oh. play ball. Why did he flip? Because he came in hard there. And they wind up only getting one out. Why did he not flip? Because the guy came in hard to take me out. Oh, he's going to get it later. You mess with the boy, you get the horns. I got to find out what position Bird plays. I'm going to truck him. I got it. Alright. See, this guy can throw a little bit faster than like 50 miles an hour. Oh my. Yeah, I'm way early on it. Yeah. The threat is at the plate. Don't worry about the runner. That was a... Thank you, Dan. You do know a thing about pitching. I was going to say, there's a curveball that just totally backed up and went the wrong way. It's the first intelligent thing Dan said in the last three years. And Dan, if you're watching this, it's up. I love you, Dan. Just not in this video game, okay? Let's be honest, Dan's not watching this. Give me something to hit, please. Oh, I did I get it? Did I get it? I got it. And the guy took a triple from me. Nope, he's going. It was too late, though. It was too late, and I hit the cutoff man, so I couldn't really go. I guess I'll take a double, but I wanted that triple. Let's see the base running that this guy does. Okay, guys. How many outs were there right there? Maddie? how many outs were there? There's one out. Okay, guys. We've talked about this before, I'm sure. But let me let me talk again, because this is like... This is one of those things that you have to understand. When I'm a runner at second base and the ball's hit the outfield, am I tagging? Am I getting off the bag? It all depends on the out. It depends on where the ball's hit. It depends on a lot of things. But the general rule is when there's one out, when there's one out, I'm going to get off the bag on a deep fly ball like this. Especially when this is a ball that's not, it's clearly not a routine play. This ball's driven. If there's nobody out, then I can tag up, okay? Because I want to get the third with one out. Because if it gets caught, now there's one out, I go to third. There's not a whole lot of reward on tagging with one out. Because if I tag with one out and the ball is caught, well, yeah, I get the second base, but now there's two outs. So it doesn't do me a whole lot. But this right here, this ball drops in, and this guy almost doesn't score. Like, if he gets thrown out here and I don't get, and I don't get an RBI, I'm definitely... I'm definitely giving him an atomic wedgie in the clubhouse later. Like, that's way too close. He needs to be off the bag. He needs to be, like, over here. And then as he sees that ball is going to drop, boom, he's off. So he... Uh, that ball hits the wall. I guess it one-hops the wall. He should have been, like, right here where that ball's one-hopping. And then he scores easy. And then I score. I mean, I don't score. I'm fast. Not that fast. Then I get a triple. But now I have to stop, right? I have to pull up here because the guy's not even at third base yet. Now it's a nice double cut. They had the both middle infielders go out. They had the they had the first baseman trail the runner. We've talked about that. Actually, he didn't trail the runner. He just sprinted 
Yeah, he just sprinted to first or to second. See, you don't just sprint it. You come in here, you get to the inside, you watch me hit first base, and then you trail me. You don't want me to know. You're going to sneak up on me. Just sneak up, sneak up, sneak up, sneak up. Because here, watch. What happens is if the guy running was actually a real baseball player, I'd be running hard. I'd be rounding hard. Now, if I round too hard, this guy can cut it, and I don't realize that that first baseman's behind me. Boom, and we throw it to, to uh, second base. And what a lot of times this guy will be yelling, he'll be yelling, trailer, trailer, trailer. He'll let you know that that guy's trailing you. But but our guy's probably sitting there, do-do-do-do-do. He's probably twiddling his thumbs, not doing anything. But a real... Fr Why are you distracting me? <laughs> oh, I got back safe? Wait a minute. Hold on a minute. They called me safe? I got picked off by like 10 feet, didn't I? I, I, I hit back like 20 seconds late. What just happened? Can I keep thinking you're going to steal? Because I get supreme speed. I, I really don't. But I honestly, I I thought I was picked off by 30 feet. I didn't even watch because I was so embarrassed. I'd like to get a replay, but it doesn't look like I can get a replay of that pick attempt. Oh. And he strikes him out here, so he's able to stop the bleeding a bit as the side is retired. So three runs on four hits. <coughs> no I got a little bit of a cough today. Were you coughing yesterday? You had your allergies yesterday. Maddie's been having some big time. He has some bad allergies this time of year. The pollen, yeah, it crushes him. Right here, the it makes my eyes get all puffy. Yeah, like real puffy and red. Give me the ball, please. Thank you. Doesn't come much easier than that. Taylor made it six four also three. Also makes my eyes super itchy and makes my throat. Oh yeah, it makes his throat itchy too. Hold on, Maddie, watch this lesson real quick. So this is how you use the bag right here. So I get left foot on the bag, and then as I, I make a little bit of move, I never want to be in here. That's the key. So I use the bag as protection. Oh, there goes the there goes his allergies. So I use the bag as protection so I can throw it, and see, now I can't get hit. And now if you still want to come in that hard, you're going to come in like that, I'm going to kick you right there. But I use the bag as protection. You yeah. might kick him? I might if he comes in that hard. You gotta let these people know who's boss. All right, we got two outs, first and third. Hoping to limit the damage. Here's the pitch. Oh wow! Way to pull the hands in, Matt. Way to pull the hands in. Nope, I can't. I would have, but he slammed on the brakes. That's fine. That's fine. Oh, what are you doing? That's a useless throw right there. And King, get in front of the bag. What are you doing? I could have went over and let that ball hit me in the shoulder and get away. Now. I don't want to swing at that OO typically because I can't do a whole lot of damage with that. But, you know, I get jammed, but I got such a clean pass right there that it's still a hit. To the plate now is the designated hitter, Pablo Navarro, struck out in his last trip. Come on, Pablo. Yeah. Pablo stinks. So they strike for three No, nobody on this team knows how to hit. Except, Except for me. I'm going to move over. I'm so scared that everyone's going to steal, but you can't steal down 8-1, to one, so. What the mat? It's routine. Can someone fix that Bayfront sign? Look at all the rust up there. Holy crap, guys. Get somebody up there. A lot of rust up there. What's that stuff that I always see commercials for? I don't see it so much anymore, but um, orange, uh, what is it? I don't know. I don't know what I'm talking about. For the 57th double play of the day, you guys broke a record. Kick him too. This guy's trying to break a record for most grounded into a double play in a game. They're going to give me one more at bat though. Look at my video game numbers here. 423 with like a million 
Ah, that ball's got to get driven, or you better hit the weight room. I was hitting 423. Now I'm hitting a little bit less. I crushed that ball right there. How does that ball not get over his head? Well, I got 1,300 experience points, but I don't think it matters anyway because they're doing routine maintenance. Oh, that right there is probably going to have to be the thumbnail. Let's remember that at the 15-minute mark. I like that. Yeah, that was pretty cool, wasn't it? Matt doesn't even know that guy's name, but... I feel like there's been a lot of maintenance with this game. Uh, Bayford, I believe. Bayfront, sorry. Bayfront Park. Though it, uh, soon, though, it'll be called Antonelli Park. Um, because I basically built this place. See all these people here watching us? I don't even know if this is our home stadium. I haven't paid attention. But let's assume it is. All these people, they're here to watch one guy and really one guy only. And it's not our home park. We're on the road. Anyways. It'll still be named Antonelli Park. And, uh, oh, Vic's back on the mound. I like Vicky and she likes me back. How good is he? He stinks. See what I mean? A little sack fly. A little slack, sack fly action. You better score, Slowpoke. A little sack fly action. He throws me cupcakes. He does throw me cupcakes. He throws me cupcakes and he Yeah, we'll call him. Cupcake Vic. Vicky Cupcake. Cute, cute cupcake. We gotta put Vic in there somewhere. I like Vicky cupcakes. Vicky cupcakes. Yeah, Vicky cupcakes. That's what we're gonna call him. I got it. Let's go. You want to, <coughs> you want to not bat against Vicky Cupcakes? Yes. Uh, I'll give you the next at bat. He does. Oh, that was so slow. It was only seventy-six. Yeah. No, and it, it was That's just, faster than your Illinois baseball games can throw. Excuse me? What? Get through the hole? Yes! You said they throw eight. Well, we have some guys that throw even harder than that. Depends on the age. I got a 10 game hitting streak. That's right, boys. We're seeing it go up. It's at like 500, Mark. Have you been watching the games? It's hard to keep it continually going up when you're hitting 500. Now, I'm no math magician, but basically I'm going to have to get like at least two hits a game. Sometimes three. That will walk them. It's especially painful. Yeah, but now the lid is extended and a base hit could blow the lid right off this. Yep. Oh boy, my back hurts. Guys, by the way, I've also, since I made that video, here we go. Do you want that bat? Alright, Maddie's gonna hit here. Hold on. Oh wait, hold on, I gotta play defense here. J.J. Bladé, he went yeah, to Vanderbilt. Hey, this kid went to Vanderbilt. We were watching them last night on TV. Can I play defense? Um, I'm going to play defense, actually. Oh. Up. Oh, good jump, Matt. Just missed it. Just missed it. Just missed it, Matt. Man, I thought this at bat was All right, here, you want to crush? Vicky, Vicky Cupcakes is still in the game. Wait, how much? Oh boy, I think you gave me your allergies. Oh, Vicky Cupcakes! See ya! See? Vicky Cupcakes throws me. Let me see that. I'll give you another at bat for this. He throws me bombs to hit him. He throws you bombs. Throws you cupcakes. 
the Look at that. Place. Look at him just sit on this breaking ball. Oh, oh, just sitting. That's advanced scouting right there. Did you know he was throwing you that breaking ball? Or was it just so bad that you could just sit on everything? He throws everything right down the middle of the Good strategy. You know, I always tell people, especially at a high level, I say, if you're, if you're trying to be ready for everything, you're ready, for, you're actually ready for nothing. Because you can't sit, especially at the big league level, or usually even in double A, you can't sit breaking ball, fastball, splitter, slider. It's just too many pitches, right? The pitchers are too good. <laughs> but when Vicky Cupcakes is pitching, you can literally sit fastball, curveball, change. It doesn't matter. You could sit e fist. You can sit all of them. Because everything is so slow and everything is so bad that you can just make adjustments. You can go sit fastball. Oh, wait, no. Here comes the loopy curveball. And you can be ready for it. It's what Vicky throws. Oh, bunt! He does. Do you want to hit again? Yeah. All right, I'll give. I got to give Maddie another at bat. This is actually Maddie Antonelli at bat, not Matt Antonelli, but still. Oh, he crushed it! Get on two! Get on two! Go! Run! Run the two! Go to go! Get out! Get dirty! Whew. You like? Wow! Well, no! Don't go to three! <laughs> I did it all out! Oh my god! You've lost your marbles. I'm gonna get cut. I went the third by accident. What? <laughs> I went the third by accident. Okay, that's it for you. I don't have the next hit. You know what? You know what? You you crushed it. You hit it. Hit again. You crushed it. Can you please run like a sane person this time? <laughs> okay. Oh boy. You almost didn't go for two, and then you said, "Screw it, I'll go for three. Give you a little change up right there. I can't speak from experience, but that's got to feel Get me dizzy. Right there, throwing a nasty change up first pitch and getting a swing and a miss on it. Now he pretty much. Oh my god, you're unstoppable. You're a machine. Stay at first, please. Please stay at first. Thank you. Okay. Maybe I'll just let you. Can you want to just come down every morning and hit for me? I'll hit a thousand. I'm going to run the bases, though. I don't think you understand the concept of. On the bases or in a diamond, and you can't just, it's not literally. I know you, I know I went to Maddie's game, when was that, yesterday? Two days ago. He's still at the level where when you hit the ball, every, it, it, two things, either every defender runs after the ball. Yesterday I got my first out at baseball. When I was playing first base, he hit it over and I grabbed it. Oh, and touch first? And touch first. That wasn't just your first out, that was the first out I've seen recorded at one of your baseball games. I'm going for it. I'm pushing it. I'm pushing it. I'm pushing it. I'm pushing it. That's great base running right there. Great base running. Now, hold on a second, everybody. And Maddie, maybe you should listen to this. So, what what you have to do at first base, okay, guys? You got to know where your outfielders are before the pitch is even made. So, I look back and I see, I think that's JJ out there. I see him, right? He's playing, you know, not super deep, but he's a little bit deep. He's off the line a little bit. That's JJ. That's, oh, that's JJ right there? Good. And so here we go. So now when that ball's hit, boom, that ball's hit. Notice how I don't even have to look. I know where he's playing. What, what a lot of kids do is the ball's hit and then they jump and they turn around. No, no, no. It takes too much time. I need to know already where he is. And so now I'm calculating in my brain, okay, it's a soft hit ball. He's playing a little bit deep. I've got great speed. Now, realistically, like, let's see this arm right here. You know, not a bad arm, just off. Right, But there's no hesitation right there for me. I'm just going, boom, because why? I know where he's playing. Don't think about stealing home. I'm not going to steal home. I'm going on the ground, though. Ball four. Thank you, Brace. Yeah, so at Maddie's games, either the ball is hit and everybody runs to the ball, or the ball is hit and nobody runs to the ball. It's, it's one or the other. You'll never see the ball hit and only one person runs to the ball. Maddie actually, I think they might have told him. I don't know if they told you, but the first week, he ran every ball. Like, he was playing shortstop, and whenever they hit the ball, he just ran and got it from everybody. Third baseman waiting for the ground ball, nope, he cut in front of him. Center fielder waiting for the fly ball, nope, cut in front of him. Well, let's be honest, no balls were hit to center field. 
Oh, Matt's Matt's ready to box. He's got his wrist taped up and everything. Alright. It's nine to one. Do we really need to sit here and play defense? I wanna be my coach should take me out, manager. Whatever his name is. Ryan. Skip. I don't know what we call him. I call him hey you. Hey you, where am I hitting today? Oh, All right, you got one more at bat, dude. We're four for four. Don't mess it up. Okay, I'll try to go. Good strategy. And You're an animal. Get through the bag. Stay there. You're an absolute animal. I hit everything. You hit everything. Ooh. Jeez, Matty base hits will call you. Or Matty knocks. <laughs> I don't know. Which one do you like more? He's one for four so far. Matty Deeps. Matty Deeps? Because <laughs> um, in my thing, I got up to a 57 overall, and I was just starting, I just started to hit home runs every at bat. Really? Started juicing? Drinking a lot of orange juice? <laughs> Oh, 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 nice. Get in there, get down. Oh, oh. Who cares? They're losing nine to one. That type of defense would have been useful about six innings ago. Yeah, fist pounds around, boys. You crushed them. We did. Nice. That Robinson Cano right there? He's the guy that can't hit. Is he the guy that can't hit? None of them can hit. They only got six of them. You had five all by yourself. You almost out hit their whole team. Ah, oh, so sorry, Vicky Cupcakes, with another loss. Is Vicky Romer? Vic Rollmaker. <laughs> Vic Cupcake Maker. Look at that. Sack fly? Well, we had six at-bats that game. We had the sack fly. I forgot about that. Single, single, double. Wow, look at that. We're going big time up. Everything progressed. What's progressed? Got better. All right, everybody. Well, that was a great day of raking. Matt still has no friends. Well, at least we have, at least the mood looks like it's improved a little bit, except these two guys back there with bats. I don't know what they plan on doing with those bats right there, but. Hey, what? play another game. I can't. I have to go to my own baseball game now. So, hey, we got Rick Wilding Vaughn over there. Look at that haircut right there. That's pretty cool. What? I dare you to cut your hair like that guy back there. The guy in the white shirt. Anyways. Um, and the guy in the red shirt looks like he's from like 19, like 76, but anyways, I got to go to my own baseball games now. We've You're got, on your phone, look. We've got a double header. Yeah, I, I'm locked out. I don't know my passcode. I've been working on that thing for like three weeks now. I'm trying every combination in the books, but Wait. can't figure it out. Four numbers is a whole lot for video game Matt to remember. He never went to Wake Forest. He's a high school guy. Look. If you've enjoyed this video and want to learn more about building the elite swing, check out our new course. We have over two hours of content, almost 30 hitting drills. We break down the exact mechanics that you're going to want to implement into your swing. I've put the link in the description if you want to go check it out.